Welcome back, Riverhawk fans. We're here with Coach Rob Messenger, Jack of All Trades USA, uh, recruiting coordinator, special teams, and DB. So uh, you obviously had a busy last couple months trying to put this all together for everybody. Yes, I have. It's been it's been hectic to say the least, but it's all it's all come together extremely well. We're very very excited about this recruiting class. Um, so let's talk about special teams and yes, DBs. Um, what about this class makes them special? Uh, just the overall talent. I think, you know, their talent and then the, the program, high school programs that they come from. They come from very successful programs. They've, they've gone, you know, deep into the playoffs. And then obviously from an individual standpoint, they're, they're extremely talented players. Um, just, uh, you have a whole skew of different people who are coming from all over, probably about a six state uh, range, mm -hmm. but a lot of Oklahoma kids. Correct, yeah, we have uh, Devin Murray from Fort Gibson. Uh, who's coming over with his brother, uh, Trevin Inks from Sepulpa, uh, another Oklahoma guy there playing in a play corner for us, and then uh, a couple Texas guys uh, and a couple Louisiana guys. Talk about the Fort Gibson twins. Um, how unique of a situation it is not just to get one brother but the twins. And Did you actually get either one confused at one point? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, you know, To be honest with you, it's going to take a little bit of time to, to be able to tell them both the, uh, for both the part you know, for sure, but that, that'll that definitely come, so. So what are, what are you looking for for special teams and defensive backs? Uh, you know, first for special teams, you know, we, we lost both the, our, our kicker and our punter from last year, um, so we were able to bring in a guy at semester who had actually, you know, kind of a unique situation. Uh, Blake Pierce, who had been here our first year and redshirted um, and came back from Glendale, Arizona, junior college, so he's gonna compete at both positions there. Uh, and then from a de defensive back perspective, you know, we're gonna ask a lot of those guys. You know, they're gonna be put on an island, and uh, especially at safety, they're going to be the leaders of our defense, and, and they're going to make everybody right. So, you know, not only the physical attributes that they, they have to have, but the, the 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 mental aspect as well. That's very very important for us. What was your part of this group uh, heading into 2017 with the rest of the MIAA? Um, you know, in the last three years, are, are we've been fortunate. We've had some very good defensive backs. Uh, we lost Stephon Hurd this last year. Uh, who was a three-year starter for us, so we do have some holes to fill. Uh, but the guys that are coming back, you know, we, we feel we're as good as anybody in the in the MIAA in the back end. Um, just have some some guys that need to prove it now on the field. Anything else you want to add? I'm good. All right.